Can you see the rock? Yes, sir. Okay. It's about this big. There's a cortex side, the unfinished side. To stone grind it, you go perpendicular to the rock this way. Real hard. See all the flakes that come off? Okay. Hold it at about a 45 degree angle. And you just want to catch this edge. You just want to catch that edge right there. That's like is that long. And that, that's just from the stone grinding. Now it turned this way because of this. If you want them to go across, just take that off. Um. You only want to take a couple flakes on the stone ground side. Right. Remember, you got to keep this at an angle. All right. Then you do a blending flake where you just do a whole bunch of real small flakes along that edge. Now you took the big flake off. The blending flakes are little flakes. And then you stone ground it again. Wear your glasses because those will pop up in your face. This is the cortex side. I'm going to hit it above the center line and you're not supposed to. But if it's stone ground good, you can do that. You get these big flakes. See, that's over halfway. Now, that one was above the center line. This one will be below the center line. Take all that out. You got over half the piece done with just two flakes. And then do the same thing again. Come back and do your blending. And that's just little flakes on the edge. You took your big flake, do blending. You got the big flakes and then you got a bunch of little flakes on that edge. You go perpendicular to the piece, this way. You can go this way, it doesn't do anything. What eventually will happen is you'll have a straight line. There's your center line. See it in white? And then find your ridges. There's a ridge. There's a ridge. So you'll only take two flakes this time. You've only got two ridges. Get your angle. You take that ridge off. And take this ridge off. I got a hinge right here, so it might not go through it. I'll try and Go underneath it. Can't get underneath it. That's how you do a stone ground. I'll take this ridge off right there. There's my platform. All that does is strengthen the edge up. Rounds it off and strengthens it up. Terrible flake. I left the ridge on. Let me try it again. See? 
I got one, two, three, four, five flakes. And I got almost all the cortex off this side. I got terrible light, so I keep missing my platform. Let's try it one more time. Another hinge. You start getting a bulb in here. Do your um, your blending flakes. Real easy taps. Taking real small flakes. There. Took the whole ridge off. Now, with just a couple flakes, you got this whole side done. Okay, I'm going to try and send one from here all the way to there. And this flake went right. three quarters of the way across. And it's the same principle no matter what kind of rock you're using or anything. Stone grind the edge by going perpendicular to the piece this way. And it doesn't matter which side you want to hit on. It's too big. I got a platform right, right here. Now I can blend this side. But all you want to do is barely catch that edge right there. And then when you, you see how sharp it is, then stone grind it. Now the edge is starting to straighten up. And once you start getting all these hinges out, these hinges will come out as you go around. Just go around and around and around. So I can't hit into here because I've got a bulb. So I got to do these blending flakes right there. And that's how you dress that edge. You got big flakes, you got little blending flakes. And you can keep doing that. And you'll take flakes off. They'll go at least halfway. A lot of them will go further than halfway. But it'll also start to straighten the piece out too. broke it but that's that's what a stone stone grinding is and you can do that you can grind this whole edge right here you can grind this whole edge down stone grind see that's sharp right now if you stone ground that whole edge down That's called a continuous platform. So what you would do is you would start on here and just work your way from here all the way down. And that's all the material you got off. That's where you get the real good flake scars from. 
like that. See the flake scars? That's what you're looking for right there. And that's how you stone grind. It's real easy to do. I'm going to stone grind this whole side. I told you about isolating platforms the other day. You see how this is sticking out right here? Right there, it's sticking out. You want to isolate that. So you take a corner and go on either side of it. Made it stick out even further. Now stone grind it, make it strong. That's an isolated platform. And I'll probably bust a piece in half because I said something. Get your angle. Hit it right there on that tip. Shot it all the way across. Off that isolated platform. That was a stone ground isolated platform. And it shot all the thickness off and took it all the way across to there. Okay, you stop.